All right, stepson, so once you've got your tent up, then you need to put your sleeping bag in place. There's two kinds of camping you can do. Camping where you drive to where you're gonna camp and camping where you put all your stuff together and hike into where you're going to camp. In this example, we've actually hiked in. So we put all our stuff in a backpack. I've got my smaller tent. If I was going to drive to where I was camping, then I would have my bigger tent because I like to be able to stand up. This tent, I can't do it in. But in both cases, when you pitch your tent and you're gonna put your sleeping bag down, then you're gonna want to make sure that it's level and if it's slightly not level, then make sure you put your head on the uphill side. In this case, I've put my head up here. Now, if I had driven in to where I was camping, I'd have my normal pillow. In this case, again, because we hiked in, I've got a small inflatable neck pillow because it's easier to carry, and I've got a, a, another neck pillow that's not inflatable, but it's not that big. So those were my pillows. Well, I camp here. So now we've slept last night. It's a little rougher than uh, on a nice mattress, but it was still good. Now it's time to put our sleeping bag away. So let me show you how to roll up a sleeping bag. So I put it down and away from me, fold it in half. And particularly on this case, because we hiked in, we want our sleeping bag small because we gotta carry everything out. Now I just take this top end and I roll it. You roll it up like this and uh, I'm putting all my weight on it because that will keep it as small a diameter as possible. And then slowly pull it to me. Now you'll notice one thing as I go, it tends to want to spread apart and every once in a while you have to pull it back over and just tuck that extra wrinkle underneath until you get to the end. And I'm keeping my weight on top of this so I've gone the whole length up here. Now I've got to this point where I've got these, these rubber or stretchy bands that are in here. If they're good and fresh, all you do is put those around like that and one on each side and that will keep it together. If you notice on these, these are kind of stretched and I've got it smaller. So when they get to this point, what I do is take the one closest to the opening and pull it this way, and I use them as strings and tie them as a knot around it instead. So when you do this, do it with one long and one short. You can tie it with a bow, and then I've got it smaller than it would be if I just used the elastic around these because these elastics are not new. Now you know how to roll up your sleeping bag, but you still got one problem. You gotta take down your tent, and that's not hard but you got to do it the right way or it's going to be a mess for the next time you try to use it so make sure you watch this video about how to take down your tent and always remember you can succeed even though your dad may not be in your daily life and you've got a dad that loves you because this dad loves you and i'll see you on how to take down your tent